Hey guys, hello everyone and welcome to the channel. So today in this video, I'm going to talk about a JRF position, which is uh, announced by uh, Tiffer Hyderabad. Okay, so on the official website of Tiffer Hyderabad, if you go, you will not find this particular notification as such, but they have announced it on their Twitter handle. So that's why I always suggest that th these days Twitter is becoming a good platform for uh, like for these posts, for sharing of these posts and all those things. So in case if you are yet not on Twitter, please try to make a profile and uh, like, yeah, you should be there, but make sure that you are not on Twitter for unusual things like for those things which are unproductive. Uh, use Twitter uh, very wisely for only for the useful things. All right. By the way, I'm also on Twitter by uh, my user ID is at the rate Nurulhuda underscore 30. So that's my user ID. And here you can see I have just uh, tweeted about like I have retweeted this tweet from Tiffer Hyderabad. If you click here. So this is uh, an official Tiffer Hyderabad Twitter handle and they have uh, basically like uh, posted this that we are hiring applications are invited for the post of junior research fellow at Ritesh Haldar's lab. Okay, so this is what the notification says the area of research is porous material for membrane filtration and one more project is there that is hetero epitaxial metal organic thin films for optoelectronics okay so that these are two different projects which are there last date to apply is 30th of june and they have given a full poster regarding it in which they have announced or they have discussed about all the details so let me just quickly open this up so this is the poster and here all the different informations are there regarding the post the first one here says that uh, the position is of junior research fellow eligibility criteria is msc in chemistry and qualified a national entrance test like gate or csr net so both these things are required remember that they also want msc in chemistry that means your msc should be complete uh, it's not for msc final year or msc first year or someone who is still in msc it's not for them it's for them who have qualified or who have covered or completed their msc and they have also qualified any of these exams like gate or csr net or any of these exam if they if you have qualified and if you are waiting and if you have not got any admission in phd then this project is for you all right Area of research, as I already told you, it's porous uh, materials for the membrane filtration and uh, hetero epitaxial metal organic thin films for optoelectronics. This is the topic. These are the two projects or two area of research for which they want uh, JRF positions. Uh, tenure for this particular work is one year extendable up to maximum of two years. So uh, generally these project work are generally done for one year, but yet they have said that if work demands more number of time or if it demands that you should give more time to the work then it can be extended up to two years as well last date of application is june 30th 2021 so that's the last date for the application for this interested candidates if you guys are interested in it uh, you may send an email to ritesh haldar at the rate tiffer h dot rest dot in so this is the email id of the desired assistant professor whose name is dr ritesh haldar uh, you have to mail him okay directly you have to mail there is no application process there is no some uh, separate process for this you directly have to mail him what you have to mail just understand that and closing their brief resume and master's thesis so you have to apply uh, like you have to mail him and closing means attaching your brief resume you should have a resume with you and your master thesis if applicable if you have done some project in during your masters or after masters also if you have done any other project you can uh, like attach that file as well now it is encouraged to enclose enclose a short description of research interest max 250 to 300 words so you can also attach a small or a short description of your research interest uh, if you have sop uh, with you that will be much appreciated but fine uh, you can uh, post or you can just write down the short description about your research interest and if your research interest is in this field then only obviously you are going to apply right uh, so yeah three things are important one your uh, like brief resume that is required second thing if you have done some project during your masters you have to like you have to give that as well and the third thing is basically your short description of research interest so these three things if you have not done any project in masters that's fine you don't have to pay, like you don't have to attach that just two things will be required in the, that case you have to attach those things in a mail to this particular email id ritesh haldar at the rate tiffarh dot rest dot in you have to mail on this all right the fellowship amount will be 31000 per month and a shared accommodation will be provided so a stipend of 31000 per month will be provided during your uh, project work and also 
uh, shared accommodation means you will be given accommodation uh, from tiffer and over there you have to share it, it with someone okay so that means a one room shared with the other person as well so this is how they are going to provide you accommodation 31000 per month is your uh, fellowship amount all right candidate will be shortlisted after an interview so once uh, the professor or the assistant professor he receives all the mail and then he is going to shortlist based upon an interview so he will have an interview how the interview will be taken and what will be the time and what will be the duration those things will be provided to you once you get selected you will be contacted through the mail okay so through mail you will be contacted and you will be given all the other informations lab web pages this https slash uh, in ritesh aldar so you can view his page to get to know about him okay that what work his lab works on what are the area of interest so let me show you that what actually it is so this is the page this is the official page of the res of the respective assistant professor ritesh haldar now you can see that uh, uh, the work on which he works is organic and inorganic functional material design uh, the general uh, like area in which he works is material uh, metal organic uh, thin film surface mofs okay metal organic frameworks that's what mofs mean uh, photochemistry and optoelectronics and pol porous polymers also he works on organic and metal organic polymers membrane filtration and adsorbent adsorbent interaction study material interface so these are the area of interest of his programming crystal growth under external stimuli so all these are the research interest in which his lab works on so this is his area of interest you can view his home page you can go to his research interest and check out what are the research interest of his you can go for the publications you can go for the openings so you can check out that what he has done now if you see in 2021 he has published one two three four and five and six research papers so he is quite productive that's what you can check out from here right now in the opening file also you will not fi find out any of these information which i have just shown you okay direct information will not be there that is just posted right now on the twitter handle and that's why i am informing you if you guys are interested in the same work okay or if you guys are interested in it i would highly recommend you to join this particular project and work under him get some experience in this particular field and take the benefit of that all right so yeah that's all for this video guys i hope the whatever i have discussed was much clear to you if you have any doubt you can drop down in the comment section below again i'll just add that and summarize it you just have to mail to this particular email id uh, ritesh haldar at the rate tiffarh.res.in and you have to mail all the required documents which they have sent okay and in the mail also specify that you are interested in this particular work and so on all right so that's all from my side guys thank you so much for watching this video i'll see you in the next one till then have a great day Bye bye